the impulse momentum principle states that the change in momentum change in momentum of a body is numerically equal to the impulse acting on the body or simply the impulse so this principle is called impulse momentum principle change in momentum of a body is equal to the impulse on the body so how will you prove this principle so how will you find the change in momentum of the body for that let's consider a body of mass m moving with an initial velocity of p0 let after a time interval of t its velocity became v the mass m remains the same the quantity mass times velocity will always be the momentum of the body so changing momentum basically means the final momentum that is mv minus the initial momentum that is mv0 so change in momentum is equal to m final momentum minus initial momentum if you take this m outside since it is common you will get v minus v0 now from the first yeah, let's call this equation as equation number one so from the first kinematic equation of motion you have v equal to v0 plus at which implies v minus v0 that is if you take this v0 to the left you will get v minus v0 equal to at let's call this as equation number two if you substitute the equation two in equation number one that is m into instead of v minus v0 you should substitute at this will be m a into t the quantity mass times the acceleration of the body gives the force acting on the body so force into time and this force into time the quantity the physical quantity which is equal to force into time is the impulse impulse so change in momentum of a body is equal to impulse so this is the way we prove the impulse momentum principle 